women and men who are opposed to suffrage, felt that women could be more influential if they weren't seen as being all tied up with that dirty political stuff. So they felt that maybe in their indirect influence, being above the fray, that they could advance important issues and having the vote might actually work against that. Catherine Houck Talbot, she was always very staunchly opposed to women's suffrage. She was a very important, very influential person in Dayton. She started the Dayton Philharmonic and she contributed greatly to the Dayton community. There's a building in downtown Dayton named after her husband. And the Dayton League has had our offices in Talbot Tower for years. People sometimes say Mrs. Talbot's probably rolling in her grave that the suffragists are inhabiting the building named after her husband.